What is up guys? Justin here, aka M here 25. I am back. It has been a hot minute. I have been busy, but I'm here back now with my dual videos. So this is about two I have like about two weeks worth of videos backed up. But this is from like last week, this the day of the sneak peek for Cybernetic Horizon. As you can see, I am playing my friend uh, Jesse, who is playing Goku, which is actually very weird for all of us because he's our blue eyes player. If you haven't seen in our video below, I'll link it. But anyway, we're playing Gokis. I'm playing my Mech Knight and Boked. Oh god, I'm so glad that this set is out now. I have my triple Morning Stars. I'm ready to go. I'm just testing this de deck out right now. But uh, Jesse here is new to the Goki mat to the Goki deck, so he's learning it as he goes. I'm here, you know. <laughs> he's my friend, but I also like I don't want to lose. So, and also, when he, when he plays another opponent who is not his friend, he's going to experience the same thing. At least I'll be lighthearted with him. I'll tell him plays afterwards. But yeah, we're just going over it. He proceeds to try and do a search. I say drone lock that. I'm not going to have any of that stuff. He can gladly send his uh, um, his, his one card for his uh, Octo Stretch. God, that's such a good card. Like, I... Not not the fact Octo Stretch is good, it's the fact that you send one equipped spell card, which is Phoenix Blade, for a level 1 warrior. That is amazing. And, and like, thinking about it, there's actually a whole list of level 1 warriors that have just recently come out that I think are just going to be really good. I'm actually going to now meddle with that, now that I said that out loud. Alright, so uh, Jesse here is going into a Link 2 play, probably Goblin. Goblin's out. He's going to use Goblin's Effect to ditch the whole, and uh, have another normal summon. Uh, so yeah, I really screwed him up here because like you can't add, like that drone and lock really does hurt this deck. This is why drone and lock is so good. It really just stops the deck in the way where they don't continue plus them. They'll get a board still, but it won't be as destructive as it would have been. Trust me, like right here, if I hadn't stopped him, he would have gotten the U lock. I would have been fudged, and it would have been a sad day for Justin. Anyway, so he's just gonna try and do his plays. He's gonna try. That is my puppy. He is tired. He came from doggy daycare and he is just exhausted. He has to hear, hear his dad talk about Yugi Mon cards. So, let's see. I think what he's gonna try and go for here would be... I think Cerberus would be, the, of course, the best play. Uh, and then try to like, at least try and make the U-Link. Uh, I mean, you gotta try. Um... And I still don't bl uh, and he can't use Goblin because he already missed the timing on that to use its uh, effect to summon. Um, yeah, he might, he just has to like you know try and lock me out as best he can. It's hard though, man. It's hard for it's hard for a player out here. Um, so I, honestly, he spends a lot more time looking at his cards, looking at his deck. Like, what do I do here? How do I uh, lock him out? How do I even continue? And you know. <laughs> I'm just looking at Jesse like, you got this, bro, because, you know, even though we're playing against each other, you got to keep a good community in uh, your Yu-Gi-Oh group, because if you don't, what's the point of playing? You, No one wants to play with you. Everyone hates playing against you, you know. Yeah, it looks like I'm just like, all right, cool. I, I, I can't judge him. I can't, well, I can't coach him because it is the middle of a duel, and honestly, he needs to learn. Oh, and the firewall. Uh, by the way, I'm going to be making an upcoming video uh, for banlist predictions because banlist is on the is on the horizon. We're all waiting for it and we're all excited for it We're, we're gonna see what happens. Uh, Mermaid comes out. He's gonna get his uh, He's Ibli and I'm just like oh crap. I hate this card <laughs> Anyway, um battling four is a good play uh, Firewall will now proceed to loop him infinite pluses I'm st even though Firewall does that, I'm still not thinking it's gonna get banned. Like, it is, like, it is, a, a, you know, I'm, I'm on the fence of, like, it's an anime character card, it has to stay, or else it's, you know, what's the point of the, what's the point of that card, if reprint, and reprint season's gonna come out. Yes, I do believe uh, anime character cards will get hit, but it's always way after the series is over, like, Ancient Fairy Dragon, character card, got hit. So sad about that still. Uh, since he didn't lose Goblin's effect the first time, he can now do it again, get, uh, another normal summon. He's just really hard up on this one, like, his hand is not as plentiful as it should be because of me. <laughs> but, uh, you know, you can only do so much. Uh, 
And this is where I think he made the misplay. I'm not sure if he was trying to continue, but you know, since he linked, uh, he could have just given me the Ibli and like at least had me on a lot, like something. So he proceeds to pass turn. You really can't. You really couldn't do much. I remember he was like, "Wow, Justin, you couldn't let me uh, get my searches." I'm like, "No, no searches for you, sir." So I'm just asking questions before I make my plays. I'm one. I'm still one of those players where I uh, want to think about my plays, make the optimal play, and get the best out of it. And if you can't, no if you haven't noticed yet, we're playing on Jesse's two mats, two mats from the sneak peeks. He's he won both sneak peek mats. Damn you, dude. Anyway, um, proceeding to set a card, summon blue sky, summon out, uh, uh, searching for ner 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 nightfall, and I got drone lock on my own card, which I don't mind, cause like this is more of like to help me set up plays. Um, nightfall comes out. Beautiful thing about nightfall, I can use him whenever to help me, uh, you know, uh, use his uh, during any during either player's turn to really get advantage off it. So I can hit, uh, I can banish Blue Sky or banish Nightfall itself. It doesn't matter. Here I was just trying to make sure damage doesn't kill. Uh, I don't get killed with damage. And if he does attack with Firewall into my Blue Sky, which I was like, encounter, which I was thinking about, I'd just run that away, get a free search, and he has to one for one me on the on the Purple Nightfall, which you know that that would be crazy. Um, also, I forgot what that set. I think I've, I think one of them is impertinence and one of them is an invocation. And he proceeds to scoop it up just because like I had him locked out. It was, it was that way. Anyway, um, so you will. Str um, I was actually no, it wasn't this video. It's the next dual video, which you will see. Um, but I did tech in something uh, in the side deck that I was trying to test out but never came out. Um, I was testing out OCG theory of. Uh, Tiamaton. Tiamaton breaks the Goki board like that. You know, um, as long as I can, if I can tribute off Ibli, perfect. If I can't, okay. But, um, you know, um, this, if they don't even have the Ibli for some odd reason, or if they do have a full board, I can break it. I can break the U-Link, especially against Spirals, if that ever becomes relevant again. But, um, Tiamaton, really good card. Um, I still believe Cyber Dragon is still one of the best plays. I actually am meaning him in this version of the deck. Uh, we'll see what changes I make afterwards, but uh, yeah. All right, so we're going to game two. I believe he proceeds to go first because it makes sense for a Goki player to go first with this kind of crap. Um, I see an Ash Blossom, I think, in his hand. I can't tell, man. Like, uh, proceeds to set one and pass. Which is a mistake on a lot of people. But when you're playing against Mech Knights, never set your cards. Never give me advantage. Uh, I'm laughing because I was just like, oh man, I keep telling him, like, guys, when you're playing against me, don't set cards. Mech Knights, never set cards. Alright, so here I am. Um, I have summoned my Invoker, my uh, Alistair. Um, I really can't wait for the next set either. I'm like, I'm always talking about the next set, next set. Because I'm just like, so excited about it. Uh for the new Link monster because Mech Knights plus that, that with fire, um, not fire, um, ooh, that Ash Blossom was good. With, um, both Alistair and Morningstar being out, like, Mech Knight and Vogue gets a lot more consistent, in my opinion. Anyway, I just proceed to set one and pass. I, um, didn't want to do too much. Uh, I don't, I think he drew, like, a lot of hand traps, if I remember correctly. He just couldn't get out of the board. So I activate terraforming, I get drolled, I'm like, okay, cool, whatever. Magical meltdown, whatever. Activate magical melt I, I would attempt to activate magical meltdown to get the plus, but there's no point. So now I'm just gonna activate invocation, I believe. Which makes more sense. Um And I think I uh Okay, and I uh, different dimension grounds, I'm like, wait, no, that doesn't get this is where I almost made a mistake in the ruling, where he was right in the train, chain of resolution. Different dimension ground still goes to the grave, I thought, for some odd reason. I was like, okay, let's talk it out for Justin to get his brain back. Um, so now Alistair and Invocation are banished. Some uh, Purgatrio game ending card, so I just did 25 damage for free. Yeah, just a lot of hand traps. He didn't, he didn't draw any of his outs. He didn't get any of his Goki cards, which is so rare. Because that deck is just all monsters with like six spells. Um, activate magical meltdown. No drone lockbird on that one. Uh, 
summon Alistar, I believe. I mean, I, I didn't draw into any of my uh, Meg Knight pieces. So this is when, like, this is when Invocation, the Invocation engine does take a good uh, control over the board. Um, yeah. That made no sense. I'm just talking because I'm trying to make sure I'm, I finish the video as, uh, <laughs> as the audio, uh, finish the video as the audio is done. And yeah, just trying to tell him I love you, dude. Don't hate me. Anyway, um, that's pretty much it. I started poking for damage. He just scoops it up. All right, guys, that's dual.